Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Majora Khan and Revelations has been released and it is an amazing map and to start you off we have a quite an easy tutorial. This is how to turn on the power in Revelations as well as open up to the pack punch. So first off we have these four locations for these corruption tables, these are like ritual things within Revelations. You have four locations like I say, so you got one at spawn, you have one in Mob of the Dead, you have one in the Eisendrak and you have one in Verux. Now these four locations have to be turned on manually, you have to pay 500 points to turn them on and they're pretty simple to do as long as you have the right weapons. Now the weapons I recommend to have is either the Thunder Gun, the Marasagua or the Little Annies, they work perfectly. But if you don't have any of those weapons, you don't think you can survive them, then just go ahead and activate it anyway. You can actually do these without killing any of the zombies that spawn in, just like the Rituals and Shadows of Evil. So I'll show you all four locations on screen as well, just so you've got a bit of a reminder there as well. But once you got all four of these done, you can basically go inside to Nactoran Totem, which is like the central point of this whole map. It's like the hub of it, if you like. And if you go upstairs, there is a computer which should have all four green lights on. These green lights indicate with each area if you've done the ritual so once you've done all four of these corruption rituals you want to wait until that big apothecan creature flies by the really big one who takes up the pack a punch at the beginning and once he flies by you want to go up to this computer and you want to hold square and this will trap him in that area as you can see in this gameplay once you trap him in you want to then go downstairs behind that and totem and then you can actually go into its mouth and he'll pull you in with his tongue and once you go inside of the beast you want to then head towards the back where his heart is and above his heart is three little pillars that you need to shoot they're pretty easy Easy to shoot pretty easy to see because they're bright yellow again as you can see in this gameplay if you just shoot all three of these then the pack punch will drop out of the heart and that is the pack punch and the power turned on by the way the power was those corruption tables once you've done all four of those that's the power done the pack punch in this map very easy to get to and also it doesn't move so you don't have to worry about that if you're hyped for revelations then please make sure to leave a like rating on the video and comment down below any thoughts you have about the map i'll be releasing way more tutorials about the map in the next few days so be sure to subscribe to my channel for more zombies content and as always guys i'll see you next time. Peace out.